Oh, it's such a good show. Very few Russian is with me now. I love that show. You know yes. what? This is, there's just something about, especially at this time right now, that you go to watch a show like that and you come out feeling better. It's a bit like Priscilla, Queen of the Desert. I mean, yeah. I, used to, I went to see that about six times. It was, you, you know, honestly, it was like, it was like taking a happy You're film. a little fan of Priscilla. <laughs> it's just so it's good. Such a and this is the show. same. Yeah, you know? the audience go mad for it every Brilliant. night. It's such a beautiful show. It's such a beautiful message. You know, just be who you want to be. Don't exactly. judge anybody. Keep an open mind. You know, that's the, the message of the show, which is so relevant right no, now. No, very much so. The only thing that's terribly annoying is, is the legs on those fantastic <laughs> drag queens my goodness they are and the stunning. figures they look yeah. amazing they look yeah. so cute it's just great so how did this all come about i mean it's come at a great time for you hasn't it yeah perfect time yeah um it all came about because um they were looking for a new um girl to play the part of lauren so audition briefs went out and i went in and auditioned for the fabulous jerry mitchell twice and then i had to be put on tape for cindy lauper who wrote all the music of course to it's cindy lauper i forgot yeah. about that you and your husband met while you were doing a, a musical weren't you doing hairspray yes um we both met on Hairspray, we were both in the cast of Hairspray, um, right. again for Jerry Mitchell, who's our director on this show. So we've come right. full circle That's and um, husband's the associate director. Lovely. So, um, so it's in the family? He's very strict. Is he? Yeah, <laughs> you have to do as I'm told. <laughs> that must be strange because you do have to have that work relationship and that home relationship. It has to be yeah. like that. It just has to be completely professional. Of we don't course. take it home. You know, we just keep it at, at work and Absolutely. he just lets me get on with it. So. And what about Emmerdale? Do you miss it? Do you miss the people? Yeah, the people yeah. are, so, as you know, the people are so lovely at Emmerdale. They're like a family. And um, they're all, always very supportive when I'm in shows. They always come and watch. Um, I have Great. really close friends still, oh, even now. Good. Well, you would do because you, what age yeah. were you when you started in Emmerdale? You must have been a kid. 12. 12 you were? Yeah, Goodness 12. me. Oh, there you are. Look. Oh, here we go, look. I know. Look at you. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Adele, yeah. Adele. Oh, it's oh, wow. But you grew up on that show. You grew up before our very eyes. Yeah, and before HD and before social media, thank goodness. Because things have changed so much now, I don't know if I would have coped. I think it would be really hard. I think that as well. Because when yeah. I started, I thought I'd have been destroyed by Twitter. Oh. <laughs> I think a lot of us are quite glad that we were allowed to just sort of develop and exactly. all of that. I mean, I had braces and I thought it was really cool to have football team colours, braces on my teeth. I just yeah, did not think okay. that was not a good idea no, at all. it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> it's all right. It. You yeah. look amazing. You're tiny, actually, oh. though. You're really tiny. I mean, <laughs> were, were you just, did you just sort of ping back after um, the baby or did I you have to work like, hard? I had breastfed for quite a long time and that was really good. And that then, does um, work. My yep. husband was working in the evening, so I just didn't have any dinner. just didn't eat. <laughs> Too busy. That's the way. Too busy, too busy, too busy to be to doing wait. that. No, but you're right about breastfeeding. It really does help with that, as well as all the other advantages, which, of course, we know about. Yeah. Um, it's it's yeah. fantastic and best for your, for your little girl. Do you think she will end up doing what you do? Um, it's too early to tell, I know, but how I, would you feel know. about that? I think what we should do is like bring her to see Kinky Boots, see if she likes it, and then we'll know. And if she sort of cries, then maybe not. And if yeah. she loves it... Yeah. Um, she can go be a lawyer or she an can accountant. Go be a lawyer. Yeah, it's up to her. We're not going <laughs> to be stagey pushy. No. My family aren't like that at all. So no. we'll keep her feet on the ground. We'll get the Louboutins out of her mouth and then keep her feet on the How ground. How did she manage to get a hold of those? Were they just like, she just went and made a meal in for them? No, it's his fault. I came home and it was just happening. So I blame, I blame, you know. The old husband. It's fantastic, it's really yeah. good. So yeah. when does Kinky Boots all kick off right. when can we see it? So come and see Kinky Boots, it's brilliant. Also we have two very fabulous leading men in Simon Anthony and David Hunter. And Simon Anthony is a huge fan of yours and he says, please come to the factory again because I we'd will. love you to come back and get I, the boots on. I, I, don't know, I don't know if I can get the boots on. What I love though, I would imagine that all of a sudden you sort of double your height. I mean, yeah. they are big yeah. boots, oh, aren't they? Oh, we've got a new um, member, um, Momar, who's seven foot in the boots. Wow. Seven foot, so that, that's impressive. That amazing it's yeah. uh, like i said it's such a great show and and if you want to just be uplifted go see it we'll stick all the yeah. details in our website of course we will yeah good luck with it thank you and i will definitely come along because it's one of those shows you just you know you walk out just singing oh, the songs just and feeling feel better. better about life and that's all right isn't it it's yeah, what we need isn't it, it? definitely is <laughs> yeah. thank you it's lovely to see you thank, thank you. you so much lovely as always